growing firestorm calls for a Maryland delegate to step down after her use of a racial slur. Hello, everyone. I'm Vic Carter. And I'm Denise Koch. Governor Lee Hogan and the leader of her own party say Harford County Delegate Mary Ann Lasanti should resign. WJZ was first to catch up with the delegate. Here's that exchange. Some of your colleagues are calling for you to resign, but others are supporting you. Any comment on that? Is there anything that you'd like to say to the people who you represent in Harford County? I have made a press statement. And are you going to stay in your post? I've, I've made my statement. Are you going to resign? I've made my statement. WJZ investigator Mike Helgren is live right now in Lasande's Harford County District with reaction from her constituents and more on who's calling for the lawmaker to resign. Mike? She could not get on that elevator fast enough, Denise, and those calls to resign are cutting across party lines from County Executive Glassman here to Senator Chris Van Hollen. Yet Lasanti was on the job in the State House today. Are you going to stay in your post? Harford County Delegate Marianne Lasanti continues to dodge the question over whether she'll resign, despite calls to step down from the governor to her fellow Democrats for her admitted use of a racial slur calling Prince George's County an N-word district. Angela also Brooks, the Prince George's County executive, made her feelings clear. Shouldn't she resign? Absolutely. Anyone who's that ignorant should resign or should be fired. Lasanti's district covers many parts of Harford County east of Interstate 95, including Edgewood, where constituents told us they were hurt. It's all over Facebook. It's disturbing because people voted for her. She should step down. I don't find it appropriate for anybody to use any type of racial slurs. It's hurtful that she has to grow up in a world where it's still racist and, you know, it's sad. Others here were more forgiving. I think she apologized, and that, that's fine by me. I don't know about everybody else, but everybody makes mistakes. Lasanti has offered shifting explanations, first telling the Washington Post everyone uses that word, then saying she didn't remember to an apology. I've made a press statement. Her statement even said that word was not in her vocabulary. She's been stripped of leadership posts, but some say the lawmaker who claims on her website to speak up for us said something so foul and hurtful they don't want her speaking for them anymore. When a public official does it, we must demand their resignation. One of the most disturbing things about what she said is that doesn't everyone speak this way? She's not alone in her ignorance and her unenlightenment. These comments were made last month during an after-hours gathering at a cigar bar in Annapolis with several other lawmakers present. The governor said today the language of racism and hate has no place in our public discourse, and any public official who engages in this reprehensible conduct should do the right thing and step down. Live in Los Angeles District in Harford County, Mike Helgren, WJZ.